The women's super heavyweight was one of the best sessions of last year's competitions and I think we're going to have another great one here today. It was a tight match with Brittany Slater and Sunita Mullu, but we have the American Alexis Jones. First time we've seen her at the World Championships and she's bringing a strong challenge today. Alexis domestically has hit 721, but at the World Championships, we'll see what she can put up under a new set of standards. Easy work. Three white lights and she is underway. See, she looked over to the American coach, Matt Gary. He gave her the A-OK. -okay. That's exactly how deep you want to squat these. Defending world champion, Brittany Schlater, is out for 260 kilos. Two-time world champion, battle-tested. Brittany has been in this position before. This is a big opener. It's going to say a lot. What do you think, Ryan? Tiny bit of work to do, but she's clearly got a lot more in the tank. Do I like she's on the board? Our final opening lift, and look at this, 285 kilos for Sunita Mulu, Belgium. She's the biggest squatter in the IPF. Not the biggest squatter in history. This is the third time of meeting for Sunita and Brittany in recent times. And that was quick, Joe. It was very quick indeed. And Ryan Sunita has put the world record for her second attempt. Alexis Jones, 260. This is a good squat for Alexis. Now this is what she finished on at her nationals, taking it for a second this time. Alexis doesn't have the, as big a squat as some of the other front runners, but also has a massive deadlift. Deadlifts not moved well. And she got a yellow from the side referee. Here's Brittany looking for 272 and a half. She's done as much as 285. Let's see how this moves. That's a little bit of work. A lot more lifting left to go. I don't want to read too much into it. Just giving you some perspective. So Nita looks like she's pacing for more. Alexis Jones looks like she's pacing for more. And we have our first world record attempt of the day. It's Sunita Muller to break her own squat world record with 301 kilos of weight. No woman in the IPF has ever done raw. Now this is, this is appropriate. This isn't cool hearted. By no means a Hail Mary pass. Despite a shaky walkout, no issues in terms of bar speed. New world record for Sunita Mulu. And here's Alexis Jones for 15 kilos more than she has done on the platform before. Yeah, Alexis has actually hit 276.5 previously. And that is scary. But she's moved ahead of Brittany Schlaten. And I tell you what, Team Canada could have easily felt the pressure and loaded up 285 because Brit has done it before. Now she could cover those five kilos some other place. This will get her back into the squat medals. Oh, what a fight by the Canadian. That was right on the ragged edge. This, Joe, is how battles are won. The lady who's already got the squat gold is coming out next for 311. We've never seen numbers like this before. 311 kilograms for the squat queen. Can history be made? Her name is already etched into the history books, looking to extend that legacy. If we block out the numbers. Oh, whoa! It's still oh. going. And she wanted it. Had to kick, change gears several times on the way up. That ground to several halts. Stop dead right there and again. But she got it moving. Brittany has hit as high as 157.5. She's in a real scrap here, barely staying ahead of Alexis Jones in the projected totals. Next out, it's Sunita Mulu, and this is a huge opener for Sunita, 142.5. She's got a huge squat, she's got a massive deadlift. Traditionally, she hasn't had the biggest bench, but she's opening high here. Alexis Jones threatens her dominance in this event. Speak of the devil. 
and she has benched 172 and a half, which is just an unbelievable number. This is 152 and a half. Alexis Jones is a bencher, the likes of which we may not have seen before. Sonita building that case to be a world champion. That looked like her opener, Joe. It looked just the same. Five kilos barely slowed her any. And here's Brittany Schlater. Brittany's gone up seven and a half to 147.5. It moved well off the chest for some weird movement at the top at lockout. A little unsteady. Here's Alexis Jones for 160. I'm okay with the seven and a half kilo jump. Yeah, I think that was appropriate. And from there, two and a half to five. Sunita Muller, now she did indeed take a five kilo jump. This is 152 and a half. Should she hit this? After hitting her opening deadlift, already she'll be at 703.5. Wow. Sunita's on fire today. She did 10 and a half kilos more on squat. This is an extra five on bench, accumulating those extra kilograms. Now here is the defending world champion. It's Brittany Schlater for 155. And while Brittany is hitting, while Sunita is also hitting, and they got the most out of brick today, three white lights, that's exactly right. You don't always get your top weight. You don't always have your best day. You can't put the World Championships off until you're feeling like you're having a stellar day. You have to put out whatever performance you have right now. 167. Alexis Jones pacing for a big total. Three white lights. And Alexis Jones tells the crowd, I'm here. And now we get into the contenders for the top spots on the podium. It's Alexis Jones for 242 and a half. You've been waiting for her arrival. Smooth opener. Now this is a massive opener for Sunita, 250 kilos, way more than she's opened with in the past. And this will already break the total world record. This will give us 713.5. And for Sunita to be pacing this quick. She is well ahead where we thought she'd be. What can Brittany do? This is 252 and a half. Brittany's got a pretty smooth, clean pull on her. I look good. She's done as much as 267.5. She did that at Sheffield in February. Now here's Alexis Jones. She's added 15 kilos. This will move her ahead of Brittany Slater. 272.5 previously being hit. See how quickly she can catch up. Oh, a little sticky at the lockout. Yeah, what do you think, Ryan? That you know, looks like it's close to the top end. I'm not sure now. But here's Sunita Mullo for 262.5 to kick that total world record. Another 12 and a half kilos up the road. 726 is what the total world record will be. And that is an insane total. Just needs to be convincing about having the hips through and the shoulders back. That was right on the margin. Meanwhile, we have Brittany Schlater. She is looking for 267.5. And this will get her back ahead of Alexis Jones. And Brittany is back in second place. But there's nothing in it. She's on 702.5. Alexis Jones is 699.5. But here's Alexis Jones with 262.5 to get in front of Brittany Schlater. It'll take her from bronze to silver. Not only that, ensure a podium entirely 700 kilos and up. Now, I'm concerned she's going to get blue cards. It looks locked out, but did she do a cystic two to one? It's good. Ooh, two to one. It looked like there was some supporting on the thighs, but she was only called on it by one referee. Jones is ahead of Schlater. And here's Sunita Muller. She is the world champion elect. And she's looking for another five kilos to take that world record total to 731. The progress she's made in one year is phenomenal. Fast off the floor. I think wow. she's locked it.
The referees say no. Now yeah. I can see the coach making his way to the jury table. Sunita's lift was good. The jury has overruled, it was a good lift. But we have Brittany Schlater on the platform right now for 269.5 for the deadlift world record. It'll also bump her from bronze to silver on body weight. No surprise there. And she's got it. Brittany Slater makes history with her last pull. Three White Lights takes the silver medal, secures her place at the World Games. Sunita, so you've come a long way, 731 kilos. Um, what were you expecting from the other 84 pluses? And do you anticipate this rivalry is not over? No, I, I think I expected more. But uh, I also did talk with Brittany. Uh, no, I did, but I didn't have a chance to talk with Alexis before the competition, but we did talk after that. The way I had planned everything out, I had expected more from them. But uh, yeah, everyone's prep goes differently, I guess. So you were more than ready. Yeah, I was. I was 100% ready to fight. <laughs> In that squat, you took 301 for your second. We thought it was crazy when you hit it in your last at Sheffield. Yeah. How far can you push this squat? Well, we'll see three, I mean, six red is the next goal. Sorry, so how many kilos is that? Uh, 225 kilos. Wow, <laughs> and, and we can anticipate to see that at Sheffield. If not at Sheffield, at World Games. So uh, that is like, well, a goal that I would love to hit for myself because uh, I think I don't want to put a limit to myself or what I'm capable of. So I always just like like to, you know, aim a bit higher. Brittany previously was the world champion. Alexis Jones just came over. She's previously hit 721. Is this the beginning of battles back and forth where the world title gets volleyed all around back and forth and we look back and remember this era like that? I think this is the beginning of, uh, I mean, the 84 plus era. <laughs> I, uh, I mean, I look forward to going head to head with them because uh, Brittany is like really a good friend of mine. So I really have so much respect for her. And I also have so much respect for Alexis for coming over and uh, showing up and doing what she, do, uh, she did best. And uh, I'm looking forward to going head to head with them. Perfect, thank you very much. Enjoy your evening. Thank you. Thank you.